Hey, Banana Bunch, Junk Monkey friends, it's Sonia and Matt coming on live today. How's everybody out there doing? It's, let's see, it's Tuesday here and the shop is a mess because it's been a team effort, but we are basically kind of redoing the shop here at Junk Monkey. We've been having fun painting the windows. I'll share with you guys in just a second, getting ready for Fort Ligonier Days coming up this weekend. So anybody local that's going to be coming out for Fort Ligonier Days, let us know below so that uh, we can watch for you. Heck yeah, you know, say hello when you do come by. So uh, today I want to share with you guys one of the flips that I'm doing here. I'm kind of refreshing things in my shop. This has been my cashier station for probably almost the last year and a half. We pack, we ship, we do everything on this table. This is like the table we, we paint on. on we did, right? If you go on YouTube and you search the weathered look, if you can kind of see parts of it that's not, you know, all beat up and everything else, because this is the table we all, this is like our work table that everybody uses. Um, so you can kind of see that look. I'm going to show you how I'm going to refresh it today and how to do that look. So this is going to be a great um, tutorial for somebody out there. You know, maybe you have... You've seen that sort of weather style that I do and you want to do like a two-tone look like say on some end tables or your tabletop or you want to know just in general, okay, I painted it once, now I want to like redo it again, what do I do? So I'm going to show you today what I do. Matt's behind the camera. I'm going to get started and let him do some shout outs in just a second while I'm getting this table ready, which leads me to my very first step. Grab a sand block. These are the ones that are on our website at junkmonkeypaint.com, the same ones I use. So they're a medium grit, and what I'm gonna do now is I've laid grays down on here. Who saw this table, by the way, when we initially did it, like, you know, uh, last summer, early last summer, so it's been quite some time. So now what I'm gonna do is go ahead and basically just kind of sand it off. It's gonna get rid of any sort of impurities, anything stuck to the top. There could be wax on here, there could be tape on here, anything to get ready to go ahead and redo this with a new, my, with a new weathered look, a new color, um, color combo, I should say, okay? Let me sand while I'm doing that. You give some shout outs. Let me know who's here. Let me go way back. Way back when. Just let everybody know I'm feeling surly today. Uh-oh. Listen, Saucy. you're feeling surly? Yes. Listen, I'm just saying, don't yes. make Matt flip his witch switch, yep, okay? Not today. Not today. Not so, today. Linda Linda's on. Uh, Stephanie, Linda, said, Linda, Linda. Stephanie says hi. Hey, Stephanie. Lulu says hearts in her eyes. <laughs> Kim gives you a thumbs up. Nancy says hello. Hello. Denise says hello. Jennifer says hello. Renee says hello with the jack o' lantern. Michelle Brooks says hello. Ditto says hi, Sonia. Hello. Um, Aurora is watching in the corner. <laughs> the little artist is taking a break. Chandra says hello. Um, Chris says hi, Sonia. Matt. Tammy Paraman Anthem says hi, guys. And Tara. Mary says, and sorry, um, say her last name again. Paramananthem. Parapananthem. No, Paramananthem. Parapananthem. Did I say yeah. it? Let's leave it at that. Hello. Hello. Uh, yeah. right. Marilyn Plummer, Susan Bates, and Alabama. Alabama Locked in the house. In Plater, you know, you Plater. haven't, you haven't give the, the Alabama have, thing. Right? I haven't. I've been in a mood. Do it. Come on. I've been in a mood. Do it. Well, I've been in a mood. Linda, yes, Maybe when you use... Maybe something else from Alabama comes when on. When you use your brush... How do you clean it? We clean it with uh, lye, with yep. our little white lye, big white lye soap. Yeah. How's the weather in PA? Hot. Hot, hot, um, hot. Debbie is Hot like Matt. Yes, hot like me. Yes, hot like me. <laughs> Katie says, hi, Sonny Matt. We're doing a similar a few weeks ago, and people oh, loved it, of course. Nice. Well, what's uh, going on with the light? Patty Shimmer yeah. from Western Michigan. All right. By the way, sand at that. I just use a brush to go ahead and get any of the dust off, okay? Now I'm gonna go ahead and collect my colors because they're on the window seals of my shop. Should we show them, by the way, what um, we've been working on? All right, I'm gonna come over you're, here. You're gonna have to give them context of what's going on this weekend if they're I not I did! Familiar. Are you not in the same room with me? It's Portland Well, I know you oh, said yeah. that, but I don't think they get okay, it. ready. It's like, it's like a big, the most biggest thing ever, okay, for this Our area, Our town right? goes from 700 people to 250,000 Who's in people. the window? Who's in the window? Anybody know? I sound like I'm talking to my dogs. Yeah, you do. Hey, who is it? Get that squirrel. Get that squirrel. You know, but yeah, seriously, I'm so excited. I can't help it because guess who it is? Guess who it is? Tell me. Do you know who it is? All right. So anyway, Aloria, who is another junk monkey artist amongst us here at Behind the Scenes of the Junk Monk. She's been working. We are redoing our window seals. And so she has been working on that. She has become on now. Come on now, be nice. Everybody wants to know. You Gloria. are such a pick. 
Yes. <laughs> people know Aloria. She does our vlogs. She's part with of me. our kid crew. Heck yeah. She's awesome. All right. So there we go. All right. So now I'm going to go ahead and grab the antique lace in the Bahama Jade. What do you think of pickles? What do you think of pickles? What do you think of pickles? Said, Tell so, me. So where's Petunia? All right. I don't know. Where is Petunia? Uh, Petunia's over Petunia's here. Petunia's being worked on over here, people. Yes. You yes. need to take them outside so they yeah, can see. Yeah, right? it doesn't Come look on. as good yes, as you Yes, yes. Tomorrow on the vlog, who wants Petunia and pickles? Who are these ones? Alright, so Pickles is on the outside, and then we're going over here, so we're so. She's been over bubbly, over joyful today, it's like, I just want the day to be, I, I want to go to bed. <laughs> You just have to You're here outside. waving, and I'm sitting there. I'm out there making noises, going. I know. And Poor Matt. Poor I Matt. Know. I know. He it's gets there. to put up with me every single day. <laughs> <laughs> you have no idea. Yes, I know. So anyway, Aloria is working on pickles and petunia. You saw the start of our windows. That's what we've been working on today. And uh, so tomorrow, when you tune back in, <laughs> you'll be able to see the finished windows because we've we've got to deck them out. We've got all the stuff taken out of the windows, and so I cannot wait to get them all finished. She's working on polka dots right now. Hello, polka dots. So that doesn't make you happy. I don't Rochelle, know how Rochelle you says, surprisingly, she just says, "Your mums are still alive!" with an exclamation point. <laughs> that's hey, that, we need that life, man. That's because um, how many times have you watered those mums? Um, uh, how many? You haven't watered them once. I've been taking care of them. <laughs> True story. True story. Listen, just give me plastic flowers, okay? I tell Matt, don't even give me flowers, okay? Just give me jewelry. You're the one who went and bought them. Jewelry doesn't die. You're the one right. who went and bought them. Yes, I know. But I, it's a team effort here at the Junk Monkey. It's a team effort. Uh, right. Look, guys. Just just look at that baby squirrel. Look over here. Let, let's, change the, let's change the conversation. So you saw me in the window, and I was grabbing my black velvet right here, chalky style paint. Remember, this is the stuff that sticks to pretty much anything under the sun, okay? Which means that's why it's sticking on the front glass of my shop right now, because I'm painting glass with it. So you can paint pickles and Miss Petunia on an old window, anything you want. You can paint sunflowers in your kitchen window and then wash it off with water, okay? Really easy peasy. So uh, with this paint that we have, the chalky style, because it sticks to pretty much anything under the sun, it makes it really easy to be able to redo stuff because even though I've already painted this before with our chalky style paint, this weathered look that you see here, I can totally redo it, freshen it up, and I'm gonna use the same colors that are in our window scheme as well. So this is why I grabbed the uh, black velvet, got the antique lace, and then Bahama Jade. Bahama Jade, baby. Bahama Jade. I love Bahama Jade. All right, do you see that? Yeah. Right there. Shannon said did her first jump monkey paint project. Congratulations! Heck yeah! Isn't it so addicting? So fun. The Power Paint Man. It's like free therapy and you get beautiful furniture. You cannot beat it. Seriously, you can't beat it. All right? I just love it so much. What's wrong? No. What's wrong? No. Why are you looking at me like that? Really Listen, you don't that. believe in the Power Paint? I didn't say I didn't. Do I need to have a Dr. Phil intervention with you, Matt? Oh my gosh. All right, so here's the, here's, here's the true story, okay? Here's the true story. If you look on this table, it's got black legs because I painted it black velvet the last time I did it with a gray top. Because it has black legs, and I'm happy with that, I can do some touch-ups if I want to. This thing has been moved like every single corner. It has been um, used and abused. Uh, but you know what, we're going to keep the black legs, I can do any touch up if I want, but I am going to change up the top because I'm a girl who loves some color and I'm kind of getting tired of looking at the gray. This is what I say to you guys, you know when you're just tired of looking at something and it's maybe fine the way it is, but you've just seen it that way for too long and you're like, ugh, I'm over it. I'm over this gray top and now I'm going to add some color in, okay? And because this table is going to be reused as part of my shop to like put my merchandise on, I have some amazing signs and things like that. Maybe I'll get to show you guys tomorrow as I redo my shop in here. I'll show you. Follow me in the next few days. You'll see what, I, what I'm all I'm doing, okay? But let's go ahead and get started. So I've got the three colors that I'm picking on right here. Remember that black that you see right here? Huh? is a dark color. So you never want to add too much black in your mix because what will happen is it will overpower, right? So I can see that my, my brush has touched the black, but I really want to make sure that I get lots of uh, the antique lace in the Bahama Jade, okay? And so now I'm going to go ahead and start. And here's what I'm going to do. I'm just going to go back and forth and let those colors marry up. And I want a little bit of the black in there because it's going to match the black legs. 
And I just want to keep my brush strokes as straight as possible to be able to create this weathered top look. So you see me do this look um, on the backs of my signs to make it interesting. Life is too boring for one color on a sign. If you saw the sign that I did today on YouTube, we have a YouTube channel. And yes, I vlog there. There's new content from me every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday up there. And uh, so, yeah, you got to make sure that you're over there so you don't miss a thing. But the sign that I did today, did you guys see it? The don't make me flip my witch switch, that was done with two colors, okay? So two colors, when you blend them, makes a third color and it makes it interesting to the eye. Nobody's got time for boring furniture, right? So this is gonna be a really cool, um, just feel like an upgrade of this. And remember as well, because that there is the antique lace in the black, when you have the light and the black, you get a gray. So it's gonna look really, really cool. All right, let me get down here a little bit more. What do you think so far? Totally like, just feels fresh, right? Let's go ahead and add a little bit more of the antique lace. This is that one that I was talking about that I did earlier on YouTube. And this is done with Lucky Clover and antique lace, okay? So this is a great, like, if you're looking for something really fallish and, uh, you know, you just want it to feel Halloween-y. halloween, -y. halloween -y. Mm -hmm. halloween -y. I'm going to add a little bit more of the antique lace in here so I can lighten that up. So we've got some furniture we need to get painted the next few days. Um, you know, working on our windows Linda today. Linda says she ordered paint last night. It hasn't arrived yet. <laughs> She's probably like that person in the meme that like, you see going around like ordered. Yep, sitting outside of her mailbox right now with her cooler and you know, just waiting for it to arrive, right? It's Linda Linda. Yes, you know what, she's been good. I mean, I'm just thinking, you know what tomorrow yeah, is, she right? hasn't. She hasn't agitated me too bad. Is she, has she been good? Yeah. You know, she, does she deserve something for her birthday? I don't know. I, I don't know. Oh, yeah, yeah. It's Linda Linda. Yes. Congratulations on the anniversary of your spawning, Linda. Yes. Linda. One more so, trip yeah. around. What? The sun, right? Huh? Funny. I think we go over the sun. Yes, absolutely. Linda that's what, that's is what 29 Sean always today. Says. Yes. And one more he... lap around the sun. It's true, right? Yeah. Um, so, yeah, Linda's 29 today. Everybody who knows Linda, Linda, Linda on here. Yeah. One of our junk monkey awesome friends one of from the first. California. She's been with us for the long haul, man. You talk about you putting up with me. Linda's been putting up with me too. You know? I'm Linda, just saying. Linda says uh, she'll be 70 tomorrow. Really? That's not oh, true, Linda. Really? That's not true. She's telling lies. Huh? She's telling lies. Maybe I should hook Linda up. Maybe I should hook Linda Linda up with my father. Oh my lord. <laughs> oh my lord. I'm not saying anything. <laughs> I'm not saying anything. All I'm saying is, how much do you love Linda? <laughs> <laughs> you're so bad. Why, why am I so saying that? What's everybody saying? Talk to me. You can see what they're saying. I can't. So everybody's saying hello you know? and happy birthday. <laughs> can't believe how fast song happy works. Happy birthday. Heck so, yeah. Get it done. Boy, that, 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 uh, that, oh, Linda said, laugh my A off. There you go. There you go. Hey, yeah. Mom, I'm coming over. What you got for supper? Yes. There you go. Yep. Yes. Yep. She didn't know what she roped herself into now. Yep. It's too late, Linda. Yep. We're on to you now. Yep. Just like glue. Yep. As a matter of fact, I will crate up my father and ship him to you. <laughs> that sounds serious. I am serious. Sounds serious. Yes. Too funny. Oh, my <laughs> gosh. Oh, my gosh. Guys, I already, it. Anna, get, 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 get the hell out. I already claimed this one. <laughs> she goes, are you, are you, Anna Freaky says, uh, happy birthday. Yes. My dad is 70. Are you single? <laughs> no, no, no. I already played that card. <laughs> Great minds think alike. I'm right? even, I am even, more, I am even willing just to ship them there. Oh, that's Pay funny. the freight. Pat Hunt's checking in from Newfoundland. Yeah. Hello, what part of Newfoundland? From my that. home, home away. Guys, how easy was this? Why are you hiding back there, Adam? You're I'm just like trying to get out. Show. No, 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 no. You've been behind there like a... What are you working on, Adam? He's been, yeah. What you been working on? What what packing paying? and shipping everybody's mail. What are we paying you for? Yes, I am just a Janice day. says, you're so funny, you better ask your dad. No, 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 I don't, no. <laughs> I learned a long time. I learned when I was about, what, I'd say six or seven, I was the adult in the relationship, so I don't ask. I just do. Funny stuff. All right, guys. 
What do you think? What do you think? All right, give me some hearts. Tell me if you love it. I know it's a little, little bold and uh, maybe not everybody would want it for their tabletop, but this is my store and I love some color. All right, so I had to like refreshen it up and um, add some color onto it. And this is gonna be like, stuff is gonna be staged on here. I'll show you all the signs and stuff that I'll be displaying on here as I put my store back together and uh, so now all I've got to do is let this dry. Be patient and watch the paint dry. My heat gun is upstairs in my studio, so I'm down in the shop right now. I'm going to go ahead and let this air dry right here. And then, and then my friends, all I get to do is I get to dry it. I get to distress it with that sand block again that I started with in the very beginnings. And then I can seal. And for this one, I'm going to seal with my banana peel, but I'll come back on tomorrow, go live, and show you all the next steps talk you through even how to use the banana peel because I know a lot of you have been like, can you demonstrate that again? I'd love to see you use it again. So I'll give you my best tips tomorrow, okay? I'm using That's banana funny. peel. That's funny. Linda, Linda got awfully quiet. Really? Oh, man. Yeah, welcome to uh, Jug Monkey Magic. Welcome, welcome to the family, Linda. <laughs> Whoa. I guess I got to pick a winner down. Oh, yeah, please do. Yeah, All right, nice winner, winner. By the way, if I want to put any black or anything in on top of that, I can totally do that, you know, if I really feel like I want to. But I'm really liking that right now. I'm loving that right now. All right, Matt's going to give it all our holler out and name for somebody yeah. who's going to win some banana bucks, $20. And then yeah. Mrs. or Mr. Winner, you have to email us at junkmonkeypaint at gmail.com and uh, put winner winner in the subject line. Do it before midnight Eastern Standard Time tonight so you got plenty of time to redeem this offer. Otherwise, it turns into a pumpkin, okay? Our winner today is T. T. Wood. Spell the T. T E E. Wood. T E E. I like that. T Wood. Oh, guys, what do you think? I add a little bit of black in there. Oh, so you can play with it, right? So, so fun. I Janice said love you scared her. It. That's Janice? funny. I you got laughed out poor Oh, Linda's oh, Linda? crying laughing. Yeah, where's Gaylene at to see this? She had to see that. I, <laughs> I got Linda to be very, very quiet. There you go. All right. We are done. We are done. We scared Linda and we painted no, the table No, she said she has tears running down her cheeks from laughing. There you go. What do you mean, Mom? Yeah. All right. Okay, so. Everybody, everybody trying to pawn their fathers off on her. I told you, me doing it. Anna, Anna did that. Yeah. Yep. There absolutely. You go. Linda's just a fine lady. Yes. All right. Happy birthday, Linda. Yep. We love you. Yes. Love you, Linda. Linda. All right. Don't you make Linda switch. With, don't make Linda flip her. Which switch, people? All Linda, right, we Linda, make Linda makes life worth living. <laughs> yes, it's the spice of life. Yes. Absolutely. For right. your light shine. All right. So, guys, this is now uploaded earlier today. I told you guys that if you want to see me make this, if you didn't get your fill of hanging out with me and Matt today, go over to our YouTube channel every Tuesday, Wednesday, and Friday. We upload new vlogs, new stuff behind the scenes, other extra <clears> stuff. <throat> so, earlier today, you can hang out with me in my studio as I put together this one. This is a piece of board that was in our basement, and uh, I figured I'd flip it into a sign today. So go check that out and get more, even more inspired today. Big weekend this weekend if you're yes. in southwest Pennsylvania or Maryland yes. or West Virginia or Ohio. Come out and see us. Come and see us. Please. Please. Come and see us. Come yep. see the Battle with the Fork. Yep. Come see uh, the big parade on Saturday. Best parade ever. Come see Matt. Come see... No. <laughs> so yeah. come... come out weekend yeah. yes absolutely yes so the shop reopens on thursday and will be open thursday through sunday this week so yeah we'll get everything reset so join me tomorrow as we okay. knock out some more projects together and i'll take you through as we finish this one and we bring the shop together in yeah we've got all kinds of stuff going this week got announcements this What's weekend that? oh yeah 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 we got nice. this you uh, know what, Matt? my buddy sean can from... i tell you something yeah we're about to hit do you know how many followers One hundred thousand followers a hundred thousand of you guys seriously tammy said can i, I hang out with you all way. saturday sure Come on. We'll but we're going to be running chairs. around like, uh, no, yeah, no, I'm yeah. planning to sit on the corner of the lawn with a lawn chair. No, you're not. Yes, because, I am. Um, I'm just going to, I'm just going to watch and be there. Uh, our buddy Sean, yes, who, our fun. buddy Sean, who you may have met, yep. will be here with a Harrison Ford themed special yes. effects extravaganza yes. on the grass and porch this weekend. Bless. Year we, we did Potter. a Harry Potter theme. It was out of this world crazy, and this year it's gonna be literally out of this world, right? So awesome! So come check that out as well. All right. So with that, we shall see you tomorrow. Have fun. Go paint something this evening. Will you? Absolutely. All right. Adios. Uh, Bye. See you guys. Bye. See ya.